Have you ever been excited to work on a project only to be stopped in your tracks by a frustrating error? If you've encountered a permission denied error while using Python's PyDub library, you're definitely not alone. Today, we're gonna to tackle this issue together. I totally understand how annoying it can be when you're trying to export audio files and you keep running into permission issues. It's like hitting a brick wall when all you want to do is get your work done. You're definitely not the only one facing this problem. Let's dive into the specific situation at hand. One user recently ran into a problem while trying to export an audio file using PyDub. They received a permission denied error even when running the code with admin privileges. Sound familiar? If so, let's explore this together. So, what could be causing this permission denied error? It often happens due to file path issues, incorrect permissions on the destination folder, or even antivirus software blocking the operation. We'll break it down step by step to help you understand what's going wrong. And stick around. I have a crucial tip at the end that can help you avoid these permission issues in the future. To resolve the permission denied error when exporting audio files with PyDub, the user should first check the export path, ensure that the specified directory exists and that the user has write permissions for that location. Next, the user should try exporting the audio file to a different location, such as the desktop or a folder within their user directory. This can help determine if the issue is specific to the original path. If the problem persists, the user should ensure that the PyDub library and its dependencies, including FMPEG, are correctly installed. They can reinstall PyDub and FFmpeg to eliminate any installation issues. Finally, if the user continues to experience issues, they should check for any antivirus or security software that might be blocking access to the file system. Temporarily disabling such software can help identify if it's the cause. Fun fact, did you know that the first computer virus was created in 1986? It was called Brain and was designed to infect floppy disks. Thankfully, we have much better security now, but permission issues can still be a headache. Now, let's look at the answers provided by other users. If you're experiencing the permission denied error on Windows and having trouble with simple audio, consider using Pi Audio instead. You can install Pi Audio via Anaconda with a simple command. Let's move forward and look at another answer. An alternative solution comes from another user who suggests installing a package called Simple Audio. They recommend running the command pip install simple audio to resolve the permission denied issue. This approach worked for them. Here's the tip I promised. Always double check your file paths and permissions before running your code. This simple habit can save you a lot of time and frustration. And there you have it. With these steps, you should be able to resolve the permission denied error in PyDub. Remember, checking paths and permissions can save you a lot of headaches. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe for more tips. And don't miss our next video where we tackle common Python errors.